trust me, you always look right. You wanna make the honors? I mean, I mean, it's up to you. You just let me know. Hot breath. Ugh. Nah, you don't gotta. You don't gotta close your eyes. Don't do that. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, yeah. Come here, come here. But just don't step on that. You know. Young thug and gun is hot. Um, he gives it a three. I'm not even gonna argue with him. He's just being very like whatever. I'm trying to look at it from this view. Mm -hmm. Right, like by my neck though, right? I'm I'm just trying to look. How you doing? <laughs> Hi. What's up? What's up? <laughs> hey man, say man, it's your boy Smoke. Back with another video, man. And this video right here, you know, I don't usually do videos like this. Like, I really, like, wanted to step away from videos like this. I, I didn't, didn't think I was going to have to, you know, sit down and talk to y'all. But I do want to sit down and talk to y'all because I feel like that was a big problem in 2019. I held too many stuff in. You feel me? But I'm, I'm really going to talk my shit 2020. Now, look, this video is not no, it's not, I'm not here to start no drama. I'm not here to start no hate, nothing like that. Ain't none of that going on, you feel me? And as y'all know, y'all know, you know, I'm, I'm, I might have fame or whatever, but, you know, I'm a really private person with my life. I don't really be exposing, like, all my moves and shit like that, like other niggas and shit like that. But we ain't, we ain't gonna get into that. It, it, it. But no, honestly, man, it's just, it's just so much, man. I know y'all hella confused, because it's just like, you know, y'all don't know what the hell is going on. I mean, is Gio single? Is he taken? Like, what's going on? What's going on? But look, I'm going to just cut it short and simple. I am single now. Now look, um, yeah, me and Ashley, we uh, broke up this past Sunday. Um, yeah, we broke up this past Sunday. Um, I mean, my birthday was yesterday. I'm 19 now. Uh, and, um, shit. <laughs> so, yes, I know y'all don't, y'all don't like to hear it and nothing like that, but, yes, I am single. I know y'all, I know y'all used to love when y'all used to see videos with me and her and all of that, but, I mean, hey, you know, things, I mean, things happen for a reason, you know, I mean, hey, who knows, you know, if we meant to be, then we meant to be, then if not, if, then, shit. So, yes, to address everything, yes, I am single. And me and Ashley, we broke up this past Sunday. I know it was, you know, the week of my birthday. My birthday was yesterday. Matter of fact, I wish, thank, thank every, thanks to everybody who wished me a happy birthday. You know, I mean, I wish I could have got to everybody's message, but, you know, it's so many people that. So, I mean, if you wish me a happy birthday, thank you so much, man. I appreciate you. I appreciate all the real love, not the fake. So, yes, I feel like I had to do this video to update y'all because I'm tired of y'all being confused. You feel me? Like, it's like we don't even speak no more. I mean, I feel like ever since... I got in a relationship, it's like, you know, like, I just, like, have been interacting with y'all less, you feel me? I really don't want to do that, you know, I want to interact with y'all more. And there's so much shit I got to say that y'all don't even know, dawg. It's so much shit I got to get off my chest. It's so, bro, I've been silent for too long, you feel me? But all that shit is out the door, you feel me? All that shit is out the door. All that shit changed, and I promise that. But yes, me and Ashley broke up this past Sunday. I mean, the first time we broke up... I had broke up with her, that was back in like October or whatever, so I mean yes, like all the little break in her back song and all this with like me and the strippers or whatever, I mean all that I did, I did when I was single, you feel me, so hey, but um, you know, we got back together because you know, I, I do love her, I mean I still do love Ashley, don't get me wrong, but it's like hey man, like after a while, like what else can you do, you feel me, like with her, it's like she's so confused, you know, like, no, I didn't cheat, no, she didn't cheat on me, you know, Ashley's like, she's a good girl, but I feel like, you know, from people in her, like, from people being in her ear, just 
telling her shit and you know just just so much like the girl is in college the girl works you know i told her i said look you don't gotta work no job no more you feel me i'm i'm trying to you know i try to make it the best so we can you know work and fit our lives together but you know i mean not everybody you know I don't know how to explain it, man. I'm a young nigga, man. I'm still, I'm still learning, man. You dig? But yeah, nah. And like the reason I broke up with her the first time is because, like, you know, we were like arguing so much, and I know that's part of a relationship. You know, you arguing shit like that, and it was, it was. I don't know. It was just so much, you know, between my work, you know, YouTube, and you know, just being in a relationship. I just felt like it was just so much at once. I felt like it was so much at once, and then plus, you know, I'm fresh out of high school. I'm getting into the real world, you know. Shit is different now, you feel me? When you're in the real world, shit is different. So it's just like all this coming at once. I really thought I really couldn't take it. But, you know, once I broke up with her, you know, I, like I said, but I, I love that girl, you feel me? So when I broke up with her, it's like, you know, you know, you see your, you see your ex or whatever, you know, it's just like, damn, you know, like I, I want her back, you feel me? Like I missed them days, you know, we, oh, we had like plenty of good times, you feel me? So yeah, that's why I knew like I had to go back and get my girl, you feel me? I couldn't just let her like go away like that and when I had got her back I remember um you know she was at work and this like the first time I ever do that I'm not even the type of nigga to really do this you feel me but if you really you know if you if you someone I love then you know I'm finna go out my way for you you feel me so yeah while we were broken up and you know I wanted her back you know I I pulled up to her job while she was working and shit I mean she gets off of work around like well I don't want to disclose that information but I got to her job like an hour before she got off, just in case, you know, she don't get off early and nothing like that. And when she got off of work, she was, she didn't even see me, you know, I was parked up in the cut, you feel me? But she was walking into her car and she sat down. I was trying to, I was trying to uh, hurry up and catch her before she got in her car. But luckily I got to her car before she was able to drive off. So, you know, I tapped on the mirror like, <laughs> and nah, she was just, she was shocked, bro. Like she didn't, ex she didn't even expect me to do that. You feel me? But she was shocked and, you know, and once again like i apologize for anything you know anything any 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 way i made you feel we spoke and then boom i was just in the process of getting her back and all that and you know we got back together and i really thought you know shit was gonna be different like everything from the past you know you know not everything's perfect you know i could have done things better she could have done things better most definitely so when we got back in the relationship the second time around you know i made sure you know Anything from the past that was wrong, I made sure I had to correct that. You know, there was times, you know, even in my videos, I'm, I'm not, bro, I'm going to admit to the shit, bro. Like, I'm finna, you know, there was times, you know, while I was dating my girl and I would have, like, a, a video, you know, with girls and stuff. Like, I'm not flirting with the girls, but, you know, like, the the face. I, I mean, I could have I could have been less extra with it. You feel me? I could admit to that. I could have been, I didn't, I didn't do nothing crazy. I, you know, y'all know I ain't do no crazy shit, but... Even that in general, you know, me having a girlfriend, you know, I understand that, but it's it's not even that. That's that's not the reason we broke up and nothing like that. But I just wanted to tell y'all that so y'all know. But, you know, it's just so much shit, you know. And, you know, the second time around in the relationship, like, I really just tried to fix all that. But, you know, it's like we still kept, you know, arguing here and there. So, yeah, like, around this second time around, it's like, you know, I tried to do as much as I can, but it just, it seemed like it was like, never really enough like really like i mean i tried though y'all y'all don't get me wrong like i i really tried though like i really wanted to make it work this second time but hey you feel me you know and you know she the reason she broke up with me i, I don't want to get like too much in detail because you know that's none of nobody's business you know that's between me and her but you know it was just you know like i said you know people in her ear and you know it's the girl like she's just so confused like she like she don't know even to trust me or she don't know whether, I don't know, it's like I can't even act like myself, like my true, true self. I can't even act like that because I feel like, you know, she's, and I felt like, you know, the second time around when I tried to fix everything and, you know, make things right. You know, like I said, I broke up with her, you feel me? I let her go, but, you know, when I tried to get her back, she started to mention stuff, you know, that could have been better in the past, so I was you know, 100% willing to fix all those things too. And I had to tell her too, that there's some things that she can fix too. Cause there's a lot of stuff, you know, that she could have done better as well, like I said, but I don't want to just make this, oh, she, you know, she had to do better. No, no, no. I had to correct some things too. We both did, you feel me? And I can admit to that. But it's like, damn, like, I feel like anything I done was like never good enough, you feel me? Like, like a nigga just want to feel love, you feel me? Like. Like, real shit, though, you feel me? But, nah, I still love her. You know, I wish her the best with school, work, whatever she got going on. But, I mean, hey, you know, I feel like, you know, 
she broke up with me the second time, then hey, you know, let her break up. And shit, I guess we'll, I'll, I'll just move on from it. And woo -woo. and I know y'all miss seeing her on the channel. You know, it was like great times on the channel. You know, the videos we used to do with her. You know, me and her, we had we had a chemistry. You know, we, we had some chemistry on camera that's like really different, you know. And we really could have like, we really could have did some crazy shit. But I mean, you know, I mean, I tried to get her in some videos and shit. But, you know, she wasn't going for it. And, like, you know, while we were together, you know, she was, you know, girls, you know, I gotta get my hair done and all that. But, I mean, she got her hair done, it was like the same thing, you know, but, hey, it's, I mean, it's whatever, you know, I'm gonna move on and shit, you know. But, yeah, I just feel like I never had the chance to give her all of me, like, you know, it's like I couldn't even be all of me, you know. I mean, between her, bro, her sister don't even like me, you feel me. And, you know, when I was trying to get Ashley back, you know, I wanted to make it back official with her. And, you know, so I, you know, I sent the mom a little paragraph saying, you know, I love your daughter, you know, I want the best for your daughter, you know. And I also sent her sister, you know, because Ashley is very close to both her mom and sister and stuff like that. So, you know, and that's something Ashley would have wanted me to do. So I went ahead and did that. But the way the sister responded, like Ashley's sister came back and wrote a long ass essay. And when I tell y'all an essay, I'm talking about more than what y'all have to write in school. I'm talking, bro, she sent a motherfucking essay, cuz. I'm talking, my bad. <laughs> hey, hold on. But like, if y'all would have seen what was in the essay, dog, I'm talking about, she over here talking about some, oh, it's always about Jill's cars, Jill's clothes, like, blah, blah, blah. Like, bro, she was going in my shit. I ain't gonna lie. She was going in on me. But I'm just like, for what? Like, first of all, you don't even really know me like that. You feel me? Anybody that really know me know I'm a solid ass nigga. And that's for sure. You can't ever say that. You can't, you can't ever, I, you, you can't ask anybody about me. And any nigga that talk negative on me is because they don't know me. Any bitch either. Y'all don't know me. Simple. So yeah, like, like I was saying, bro, she wrote me a whole essay hating and shit like, I mean, you know, some of it, you know, she was talking about a relationship. I can understand that, you know, she want the best for her sister, but bro. That girl was hating on a young nigga, dog. But you know, I'm going to keep it professional. I ain't even going to sit here and... <clears throat> you feel me? I mean, matter of fact, I already did it. So what? Two hours later. Okay, now that we got that out of the way. But honestly, nah, like I said, I'm not here to start no drama. But me, from now on, I'ma just say what I gotta say and just keep it real with y'all, straight like that, for real. But I mean, hey, you know, my birthday was yesterday, you feel me? I'm 19 now, I'm about to move into my first apartment, you know, I can't wait for y'all to see it, you feel me? Shit gonna go crazy, I feel like this channel's just gonna be on some whole different shit, and, I, and I'm just waiting for it, and I know y'all can't wait for it. But hey, you know, all y'all that truly, truly support me, I love y'all, you feel me? All the fake love, <laughs> that shit out the door, you feel me? Y'all can go somewhere else with that. Y'all keep that Y'all, 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 y'all go subscribe to somebody else. We, we gonna keep all the real niggas over here, you feel me? And the real females, because I know I got some wonderful females that watch me too. But, um, hey, it's a, it's a new chapter, new crib coming, you know, birthday. And shit, it's time to tackle on all the goals I set for myself in 2020. I don't got nothing holding me back or nothing else, so, I mean, hey, it's no excuse. And all you YouTubers, I recommend you stay on your pivot, cause I'm about to run this shit the fuck up. Slap! Breaking up bed, breaking up bed, no. Show on that lame nigga, he ain't got stacks, no. Show on that broke nigga, he ain't got racks, no. That little nigga so cat passing my.